So we have another case of a troglodyte cave beast white woman having a public meltdown because of black people. This time, um, this cave beast racially abuses and assaults a 15 year old black boy. This happened in, uh, I believe, North Carolina. Um, so this woman, excuse me, South Carolina. This happened in South Carolina. This white chocolate eye cave beast is 38 years old. Her name is Stephanie Sebi Strimple. Um, she was at some kind of pool or public pool in uh, South Carolina. She saw a 15 year old boy pretty much. I'm pretty sure minding his own business. And she confronted him saying that this black boy does not belong, a.k.a. This is my country. This is my land. You black niggers don't belong on my land. Go back to Africa. This is basically what she was trying to say. Right. And we, we, we all know that's that's intellectually dishonest. It's infactual. And we have always been the indigenous ancestors of this country. We came from Africa. Our ancestors came from here. We were the first ones here. These are scientific facts. These cave beasts, chocolate diet bastards have always lived in a fantasy world. They're trying to see what happens is when these meltdowns by these cave beasts and white people in general, you know, they're trying to live up the fantasy of white supremacy by making the white supremacists so overt. They want to make sure that they, you know, they want to make sure that their voices are heard and they're being caught on camera looking foolish. Right. This is why we need to shame these dudes to oblivion. Shame these cave beasts to oblivion. You know, this woman got arrested for assaulting this 15 year old, uh, uh, 15 year old kid at a pool. And it's caught on video too. Some a portion, a small portion of it was caught on video as well. I'll play it real quick for you guys to see. Wow. See, that's assault right there. So when someone has a, a camera phone and you hit the camera phone, that's assault. That, that's assault. So she got arrested and rightfully so. And, um, you know, she is uh, has been arrested. She was charged with third degree assault with two counts of assaulting police officer while resisting arrest. She, so she was also resist, resisting arrest. And I believe on this report, on this story, that uh, she was biting a uh, police officer or whatever the case may be. Um, I believe this is her husband or partner, or whatever the case may be. Um, if you read the book ISIS Papers by Dr. Francis Cress Wilson, these chocolate like cave beasts have penis envy. Um, this is all all it is. This is just penis envy of black men. It's all it is. This woman was rejected by black men growing up as a, as a child. She always loved black men. This is her way. Having this behavior, showing this behavior. This is her way of showing you, right? showing you out of the years of frustration of her being rejected by black men this is her outlet to show you know that she always wanted to be embraced by black men and her way of coping with this is to act out and she acted out in public by attacking this innocent black child at a pool you know what I'm saying so that's all it is, man. White women have penis. If even black, even 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 um, not only white women but white men, they all have black penis envy. Read the ISIS papers. That's all it is. That's all it is, man. Penis envy. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we need to go ahead and meme 
this K beats to death. We need a clever hashtag, like uh, permit hashtag, permit patty. I can't come up with a, a clever hashtag for this woman. She got a long ass name. Stephanie Sebi Strimple, who's 38. We need to have some kind of hashtag and meme this woman to death and just shame her to death to oblivion. So let's come up with a hashtag family and, and, and let's just shame this woman to death. And um, whatever job she works at, shame her to shame her to the point where she's fired from her job. I don't know where she works at or whatever the case may be. But let's come up with something big for this woman so we, we can just shame her to oblivion. Come up with something. You know what I'm saying? So leave your comments down below and uh, put your hashtag, your your shaming hashtag for this woman and let's just let's just make this go extremely viral and uh put this out in, in into the uh social media universe and just shame this woman to death you know what i'm saying let's just let's just go ahead and do that you know what i mean so anyway fam that's all i got for now from this story i'll have the link below to the story in the description so you can check it out yourself until next time family chauncey aka the black separatist Signing out. Peace.